Okay, let's add our audio track. So we'll go to oops, go to open file. I've already added it in there. Music with drums, FX is the one you want. And what I did was I actually added it to my playlist. So it kind of appeared here and I so it kind of appeared here and then I just dragged it into my playlist. I can do it again. So it shows up here and you just kind of go whoop. So now I have two copies of it. And here you only need about 30 seconds of it. So let's just set our out point at 30 seconds. Let's just kind of Oops, that was not the right one. So I'm looking at the seconds here. So it gets pretty dramatic, but we'll cut it off at at uh, 30, 30 seconds. I mean, yeah, 30 seconds exactly. It's going to pop out, but that's all right. So I'm going to hit my out point there, O for out. So then I'll need to drag this into my timeline, right? So this is where we have our different audio tracks. And what I like to do is put, because I still want this audio here from the scenic one. So I'm going to add another, another audio track. And that adds it down there. So I have two audio tracks and one video track. You can make your let's make some tracks shorter because I can't stand these really, really big tracks. In fact, you can make this actually bigger just by dragging this up because that makes it a little bit more appropriate. So now we need to drag this onto our timeline so we can just start it, um, put our playhead at the beginning. Come on, come on, come on, there we go. So, um, so this is my edited clip. This is the original clip. This is the edited clip. And you can overwrite this, Not append overwrite clip onto the current track. So overwrite clip onto the current track. Hit that one. Or you can just drag it because it's already edited and drag it onto the track. Okay. So this is pretty, pretty soft moves up a little bit. So we're going to boost it just a tad. So let's add the filter in there. So the way that you know you're working with this particular clip, you go to filters, music with drums X, you add the filter there and you'll need to work with the gain again. And we're just going to boost it just a little bit. So especially in those high points right here, it doesn't want to go too high, so it shouldn't be too much in the red in these peaks. So that's good. So that's your that's your music track. 